What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Yellow Walkthrough right here on our Gym Leader Draven channel. And yes, you did see it in the preview, we defeated Misty for our second badge. Let's go ahead and prove it. Oh yeah, look at that. Feels a little heavier now, because it's a new badge right there. But, you know what? It's time to move on. But first is first. We need to get something that, you know, is owed to us. Go into the bike shop. You go right here, talk to this guy. He's like, oh, that's that's a bike voucher. Okay, here you go. And so we exchange that bike voucher for a bicycle. We don't even have to spend a million bucks for that. That is a, something something awesome right there. Now, number two. You see this bush right here? This is the one thing back when I was like a kid. Oh, man. That was the one thing that was preventing me from going to Vermilion City. That was like a nightmare. But now, we defeated Misty. We got the cut technique. And yes, I did teach my Dubasaur cut. So, look at that. Easy. Easy stuff. And why am I walking? I got a bike. I got a bike now. Let's go. Alrighty, look at that. Easy stuff. Oh my god. Feel the wind. Getting to Vermilion City a little quicker. Probably use it in here. Oh yeah, you can use it in here. Look at that. That's awesome. Using a bike, finally. Jeez. Man. This is some good stuff right there. Okay. Time to move on. Right here. You see that? Quickly. Oh man, if we would have if we would have had this bike earlier, this would have been so much quicker. Okay, so let's see. We got this lady to talk to later on, but now that we got the cut technique, let's use that cut technique. Alrighty. So here we are in the Vermilion City gym, and I'm not gonna cut anything. I'm gonna get off the bike. Okay, so let's go to this sign right here. It says Vermilion City Pokemon Gym leader or Pokemon gym leader Ten Surge the Lightning American so obviously he is an electric type gym leader and there's the guy that only well the only man that's ever believed in us and he's like this yo champ in the making Lieutenant Surge has a nickname people refer to him as the Lightning American he's an expert in electric Pokemon birds and water Pokemon are at risk beware of paralysis too Lieutenant Surge is very cautious you'll have to break a code to get to him. Okay, alrighty. So first is first, we gotta beat all these guys. So Sparky, take a take a breather. Let's go to Thrasher right here. Okay. This is no place for kids. Hmm. Alrighty. Let's do this. Okay. Here we got a sailor, and he's got himself a Magnemite. Okay. Not what I was expecting, but okay. And it's a level higher than me, which. Cool, but here we go with a thrash attack. Finally. Oh man, this guy is gonna pay. He's gonna pay. I love this thrash attack, man. It's so awesome. There we go. Easy victory right there. Wow, you surprised me. And we talked to him some more. He's like, Lieutenant Surge set up double locks. Here's a hint. When you open the when you open the first lock, the second lock is right next to it. You know, that's kind of hard because everything is right next to everything. See? Nope, nothing. Nope, nothing. Nope, nothing. And I'm going to go right here. Nope, nothing. Nope, nothing. Huh. I'm looking at everything, guys. I really am. But I usually have a hard time just looking for this key because it's... Oh, Jesus. Okay. Okay, it could be on the top. It could be on the side. The second... Oh, my God! Okay, all right. <laughs> I I got it. All right, never mind. I'm a lightweight, but I'm good with electricity. Hmm. So that was easy. That was very easy for me to find those those uh <laughs> those keys. Usually it takes me like about a good ten minutes to get that thing right, but I got it right. I feel pretty proud of myself. I'm giving myself a pat on the back. That's pretty awesome. Good job, Edgar. Good job. Good job, Draven. So, there it is. And, uh, well, I'm just gonna continue on right here. Alright, here we go again with another thrash attack. Thrashing about. 
And uh, I think I should be switching up my Pokemon right here because Thrash does cause confusion. Let's go with the Voltorb. Okay, so let's go with Dubasaur right here. Just to prevent any confusion. And, uh... Okay. Let's go with that Vine Whip. And yes, I do know... I, knew, I do know the risk of teaching Dubasaur or Bulbasaur or Ivysaur uh, cut t the cut technique. It will never go away, but I may trade it to my Pokemon Gold or Silver just to delete that move. I don't know. Not right now. I, I, I have no... Like, I don't know, but we'll see. We shall see, guys. So here we go with the, again with the Vine Whip. And there it is. Another victory for us right there. Look at that. Fried. Okay, and we got one more guy here. And we should go with Thrasher yet again. So here it is. When I was in the army, Lieutenant Surge was my strict CO. Or was a strict CO. Huh. Strict Colonel. Not bad. So here we go. Another gentleman. And he's coming out with his Voltorb himself. And. Well. Okay, okay, okay. I'm just gonna use Thrash all the way. Now, Voltorb is naturally fast because it's an electric type Pokemon. There we go again. Thrash attack. Oh, come on. I should I should have just beat him right there. Okay, Thrash it about yet again. Say bye. Oh, yes. And, uh. Well, we got a Magnemite right here, so hopefully. Thrash. This Thrash attack can beat him in one hit. No, so I'm. Oh god, I'm gonna be confused right here. Yeah, okay, so that's the risk right there you, you guys are willing to take on using that Thrash attack. It's very, it's very powerful. It's very, very powerful. But you do have the risk of getting confused, and that's the reason why, you know, I hardly use it in other games because, you know, there, 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 there are much better alternatives. So, defeating that guy, it is finally time to take on that guy. And, you know what? I'm going to do exactly what Ash Ketchum did. I'm going to beat this guy with just a Pikachu. Dear sweet Arceus. Eight pound baby Arceus. Help me beat this guy. Alright, let's go. It's like, Tan Hut! Welcome to the Vermilion Gym. Will you look at that? A pint-sized challenger. <laughs> you got you got big and brassy nerves to take on me. With your uh, puny power. A Pokemon battle is war. I'll show you, civilian. I'll shock you two into surrender. Well, I don't know. I don't know about that. I really don't know. But I think I can. I think I can beat you. I think I can beat you. I don't know. Can I beat you? I can probably beat you. All right. Let's do this. Bring it on, Lightning American. So here we have guys, Lieutenant Surge also looks like Guile. And here he has his Raichu. Going out with my Pikachu. Going into our second screen right here, as you can see guys, in Pokemon Red, Blue, and Green, he does have three Pokemon. One being Voltorb at level 21, which has Tackle Screech and Sonic Boom. You got Pikachu at level 18 with Thundershot Growl, Thunder Wave, Quick Attack, and his you know, his mascot Pokemon, Raichu, at level 24, which has Thundershock, Growl, and Thunderbolt. Now, in Pokemon... In Pokemon Yellow, <laughs> it's nothing... It's just one Pokemon, and that's because it's based off the anime. He does have his Raichu, and it's at level 28. Has Thunderbolt, Mega Punch, Mega Kick, and Growl. So, going back into this, let's do this. Body Slam Attack, and... Uh, wow, he, he, he was ready for me right here. So I'm, I'm going to try and para, um, paralyze him right now. But he's lowering my attack every single time. And that was a critical hit right there. And there goes that Mega Kick. Oh my god. <laughs> Beats him in one hit. Oh my god. Okay, Godzilla, let's do this. Let's do this. Seismic Toss. And there's that Thunderbolt that we've been... That dreaded Thunderbolt we've been waiting for. Does it? Oh god. This thunder. This, oh wow. Okay. Ultra Psycho. Let's do this. I wasn't gonna use you, but. Seemed kinda unfair. Let's go with that dig attack, and wow. He's using that egg speed, so you guys gotta be aware of that. So. 
Mega Punch would have defeated me, but no. Critical hit and it's super effective. Ultra Cycle wins this one. And he gets all the experience points, which is pretty awesome, I guess. And he's trying to learn Disable. Hmm. Should I? Nah. You know what? Disable's not gonna work for me. So he did not learn Disable, and there it is, guys. We defeated Lieutenant Surge, also known as Guile. Whoa! You're the real deal, kid! Fine, then. Fine, then. Take the Thunder Badge. And there it is, guys. We got another badge. The Thunder Badge cranks up your, your Pokemon speed. It also lets you or your Pokemon fly anytime, kid. You're special. Take this. And here we have the TM23, which is also Thunderbolt. Teach it to an electric type Pokemon. And I got a Pokemon ready for this one. A little word of advice, kid. Electricity is sure powerful, but it's only useless against ground type Pokemon. That is true. That is true. Thank you, Lieutenant Surge. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and talk to this gentleman again, and he's like, Whoa, that, that match was electric. Alright, okay. And, uh, well, we are a certified trainer here in the Vermilion City Gym. Time to move on. Time to move on, and, well, let's go right ahead and, uh, let's see, Dubasaur. That's good. Now, before we talk to this girl, we need to go back to the Pokemon, uh, the, the Poke, uh, Pokemon Center. We gotta heal our Pokemon and we gotta deposit one Pokemon because she won't give us the, the Squirtle unless we don't have an open slot right here. So here we have six Pokemon in all. Makes two, he makes two of our Pokemon fit in one attack. Wow. Nearly beat him with a Pikachu. He's like, they're fighting fit. Thank you. And uh, we hope to see you again. And uh, okay. I gotta send one Pokemon. For right now, I'm just gonna send. Yeah, for right now, I am going to send Thrasher. Just for right now. But here it is. We're gonna just go talk to the lady. See what she can give us right here. Okay. Talk to her. You have the Thunder Badge? You must be a good trainer. I just got a squirrel that was uh, always getting into mischief. Would you, would you take good care of it? Heck yes! So here it is guys, we have another Pokemon, another starter Pokemon, and uh, hmm. No, I'm not nicknaming them. But we shall see the Squirtle right here. As you can see, this is Squirtle, the water type Pokemon. Its defenses are pretty damn good, and everything else is evened up, and as you can see, it does have three attacks, and it's pretty close to evolving right here. Now. Normally, I would use the three, the three starter Pokemon. I would, but since I have Hydra already as my Water type Pokemon, Squirtle is gonna take, uh, he's gonna sit the bench right here. Um, that's why I didn't nickname him. Now, I did have this idea. Uh, maybe later on when I do play Pokemon Crystal, because remember, guys, I did say this in the beginning of the of the series that I will be playing Yellow, Crystal, Emerald, Platinum. And then so on, on, so on and so forth. Once I play Crystal, there may be a huge chance that I might be putting Squirtle into my team for Pokemon Crystal since now I have it and now I can trade it. Chances are I might even use Dubasaur in that series too because like I said, I may be uh, switching up Pokemon here and there. This team is not exactly the set team right now. So, hope you guys are ready for those. And, uh, well, we finished up right here, and before we do anything else, let's go ahead and show off the third badge right here. So there it is, guys, three badge out of eight. That is great. I cannot wait for the next episode. By the way, the next episode you, you cannot miss because it's about Mew. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode where we, where I show you how to capture Mew without any cheats. See you guys.